I finally decided I wanted to try to run again. And I just thought, you know, that's another stepping stone of something I want to try, something I want to accomplish. So now my new goal is to finish the Rock and Roll Dallas 5K. It was May 9th, 2009, and we um, decided to go and anchor out at Pine Key Island, and then all of a sudden the boat just blew up. It felt like I was flying through the air for a while, everything went black. It's a little surreal to be back here. It really made me realize that we should never take anything for granted. Uh, I used to take a lot of things for granted, and I don't anymore. As I was laying in the hospital bed, I didn't really know what my future was going to be. I didn't even know if I was going to be able to walk again. Taking those first few steps, I kept pushing myself more and more and thought, you know, I can keep going, I can keep going. Getting my mobility back was huge. I don't even know how to describe how I felt, you know, it was just this huge rush of adrenaline again, getting that sense of humanity back. Mike receiving his new legs is a catalyst to do so much more in the future. Mobility is about empowerment, about enrichment, about achievement. And for Mike, this is great. This is his opportunity to really achieve something wonderful. We believe that everyone should live a fulfilling, authentic, better life. And for Mike, that's exactly what he's doing here. And he's experiencing something that a few years ago he probably thought would never happen in his future. 3.1 miles is a long ways. I'm definitely very nervous about it. I am making progress, but I'm definitely not there yet. It is, it's a long ways to go. My dad definitely gets his strength from just being around family. I think the accident has increased our love for each other. We're definitely hard on him. We're very competitive. You know, we're always trying to push him to become even better. This race is definitely a lot longer than he's ever done with his running legs. He's gonna struggle, but he'll pull through.